This is the painting I painted yesterday and I thought it was beautiful but now I hate it. No god. Hello everyone welcome back to my another video. As I was saying I thought this painting didn't need any improvement or anything like that but little did I know today I would gonna hate this painting. I hate them. It happened so many times to me. So that's why I want to suggest you fellow artists out there don't put out your art into your social media account or post anywhere else or so to anyone else before you make the correction your painting needs are you getting what i'm saying i'm just saying that take your time to your painting as soon as you finish your painting forget about it i know you like to post it quickly after you finish it but hear me out you don't want to do that it's not finished yet let me tell you what you should do just go out anywhere somewhere or start your next painting i don't know do something but don't just stare at your painting that you thought you finished so when you come there, it might be tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. You're gonna find so many mistakes, man. And you're gonna hate it. You're gonna hate that painting. So yesterday, I thought this painting was beautiful. I liked how the water turned out. And I, and I, and I wasn't going for the realism here. Uh, I just wanted to capture the feeling. Hence, I like the background. As I was working on this painting for more than two hours, I was lost into it and couldn't see mistakes. The goal here also looked fine to me. See. She looked perfect but today now i see i don't like the lighting on her and the hair looks kind of wonky too messy and also far from her body but that's not how the long hair behaves <laughs> hey let me remind you something subscribe subscribe mm, your ideas are intriguing to me and i wish to subscribe to your newsletter subscribe 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 go subscribe all right um so all these mistakes i had to correct them so I added the next layer and switched that layer to the color dust mode and painted with the brighter red colors which increased the contrast between the light and shadow more which I think it looks good now and I also cut down her hair which I think was too much now I think the background is also too sharp and meshy so I thought why not blur the background and keep the girl in the focus as soon as I did that boom now everything looks pleasing in their place but who knows, I might find mistakes again tomorrow. But I think it is better than what it was yesterday. It is, isn't it? What do you think? So here's the full time lapse of this painting. I have sped up this video by 100 times. So it's gonna be under a minute. Just enjoy the progress of the painting. I'll catch up in a minute. Alright, if you like this video, I'm sure you also like this one. So go see that. And please consider subscribing if you want to see more videos from me. So I hope you guys are fine. Without further ado, let's continue the video. Alrighty, let's go. 